They lied. They canceled her lingerie runway show she booked out of Woodland Hills when it's from France, and she always booked international campaigns, commercial theatrical without being a prostitute. They have the most successful career, more successful than the Kardashians who are prostitutes for the lingerie and for every media job. It's just that they made it so that their checks are stolen. Charles and her worked from LA to Orange County to Palm Springs without ever doing drugs and worked Monday through Sunday, full time. The brothel network partied on drugs Monday through Sunday for the past 20 years, threatening them, inviting them to go to the club every day. Everyone is exploited by this network, with every profession. They just think they can get away with it because they got away with it with so many people because they were worshiping the angels and saints and the parents were paying off the church to cause heroin with these addicts who were doing drugs every day. It also leaves their millennial network homeless. So they're tortured every day homeless. Charles has been homeless for four years because he's not sleeping with someone for money. All over the world, 20-year supermodels and 20-year producers are more successful than any of the club network who exploited them every day. They're all cut off from their society. It's an Amish community completely cutting them off. They're willing to pay everybody else. Charles was bullied by a gay Muslim roommate who was having gay sex with a UCLA um, psych ward assistant. They planted needles in Charles's room and the guy admitted to doing it. He did their dishes every day. Instead of going on Craigslist, he had posted an ad at UCLA. Brittany was with him and he said he's a Christian and he's a Christian. His family goes to the Jewish church. His mom's a widow with a fatherless family of seven and it's overwhelming because it was pretentious at the Catholic church she went to when she can't worship the angels or saints, giving them money when they'd be paid to sing in the Catholic choir, like he, how he was singing in the Catholic choir till 25, as a 25 year old virgin. They should have been paid. But the problem is worshiping the angels or saints. They can't pay any of the church with any charity. They have to pay their own kids. So Brittany's a Christian and told Charles not to worship the angels or saints because it's a major problem. I'm sure they know this now and Charles's widow mom is a Christian. But the problem is, is that they have no support whatsoever. Charles got a ride from Brittany who hadn't seen Charles in a month. And he had a black surgeon slice his foot open five inches four years ago without any anesthesia. It's because he was racist. Charles is the only Christian in his family because they are Jewish, but he was raised Christian. It was just the one prayer that was worshiping the angels or saints. And she told him not to, and she told her network to help Charles's mom and to help Charles's family. It's so important because they know not to worship the angels or saints, but they owe the money back and they were supposed to pay them and pay their whole family. It's a major problem because these Christian baby boomers are paying the church while their kids are sex trafficked. Charles and Brittany.